Hey everybody, it's Ravenways. Welcome to my channel. So this is a little bit of a different video, but it's something I thought I'd, I, you know, add to the bunch every once in a while. What I'm doing here is a review of a homemade product, okay? So, you know, online you hear about, um, you know, uh, people using vinegar to clean things up, right? To clean everything. You can clean everything with it, okay? Um, but what a lot of people say is that if you uh, take some regular vinegar, right, put it in a jar and add some orange peels to it and wait for about a month and then um, take the orange peels out and, you know, filter filter the vinegar into like just a regular little spray bottle like I have here, okay, you'll have a very powerful um, and environmentally friendly cleaning product. So that's what I did, okay. So I had another jar, like a little mason jar. I filled it full of vinegar. I put in one whole orange peel. It was a large orange and I took all the peel off and I put it in. Okay. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to tell you, like, I'm going to show you how it cleans. Okay. Cause this is my really dirty sink. There's makeup stains in here. Um, lots of makeup stains, dust, um, uh, juice, whatever. Okay. It's a dirty old sink in my bathroom. Okay. That I haven't cleaned in a week. And this is my homemade orange vinegar cleaning product. Okay, that you and you see this all over the place, and everybody talks about how great it is. So, I've got this. I've got a J cloth. Okay, that's um, it's just been dampened. That's all. So I basically um, washed it in some hot water and then wrung it out. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to just demonstrate for you um, how this product that I made. Okay, this environmentally friendly product that is all over uh, YouTube and Instagram and everything if it actually can clean up some makeup stains, this is foundation, eyeshadow, um, you know, um, just, you know, scummy old sink. So let's try it out. Now I'm doing this on my phone. So here we go. I'm going to give it a good spray with this, oop, <laughs> this homemade product. Okay. I'm going to tell you also how it smells because everybody says that if you use this, it's going to smell like oranges rather than vinegar, which can have a really sort of a nasty smell to it. Okay. So there's some scum on my little, um, plug. Okay. So I'm dosing that with orange peel infused regular vinegar. Okay. I'm going to put this down and I'm going to see how this works. Okay. I'm going to see, first of all, it smells very strong. Okay. And it smells, yes, it does smell like citrus. Okay. But it still smells like vinegar. Okay. Now, is it getting the sink clean? Is it getting the sink clean? Let's see how it's going to do here. Okay. So this sink hasn't been cleaned in about a week and it's been used a lot by my family. For all different things, I think I even um, planted something in here. You know, I used it. Okay. It's not. You have to kind of. You have to sort of scrub a bit. Now, obviously, if I had a sponge, it'd be easier. But most people uh, forget to buy sponges, but they have cloths. So let's just see how it looks. Let's keep it going. I'm going to spray some more in. So. I left the orange peel, okay, the whole peel of one orange with, I don't know what this is, about two cups of regular vinegar in a separate jar for just a month, I think just under a month. Okay. And we're going to do this. Just I'm going to do this. Okay. If we do the taps, do the plug, so this was really dirty. Now this has taken me what? Let's say about two minutes of cleaning here. Drain's a bit dirty too. Right, maybe that's just the light. Okay. 
Now I'm going to use some hot water and wring out all this vinegar and orange. So it's an orange peel vinegar um, infusion and you just do, you just add regular vinegar and one orange peel. I, I had only about two cups of vinegar left, but you could do it with, you could probably probably use a lot of orange peels. Okay. So there you go. You be the judge. I think it looks really clean. Here, just see if the scum has come off of that. Yeah, that's a pretty, that's an old plug. But let's see. If you leave it on the plug for a little while, it start the scum starts to come off. I think this is actually pretty good. I, I'm actually surprised. Okay, now you will see, if you look at my tabs, there's a bit of scum there, okay? So I'm gonna dose this. Boom, boom, boom. So my face is pretty close to spraying this, all right? And I have to say, it doesn't, it's, yes, it does smell citrusy, and it smells less of vinegar, but it still smells like vinegar. So if you make this product at home and you think, oh, it's gonna smell just like oranges instead of vinegar, wrong, it smells like vinegar, but it's less of a, less of a vinegar stench. But um, if you, like if you get close to the sink, it's, it does not smell of oranges, it really doesn't. It smells of vinegar, okay? But less than if it was just pure vinegar, because I have cleaned with just pure vinegar before. And um, it doesn't it, it doesn't smell as strong as that. Okay? Not bad. Not bad. I, I you know, I'm I'm just looking at it. Let me just clean in here. Now I've used up quite a bit, so really um, you really have to buy, you know, get yourself a large bottle of the vinegar and maybe instead of one orange peel, several. Some people add lemon as well. I don't think that would get rid of the vinegar scent. So if you do make this, it does clean up a, a sink pretty well. Um, as far as the scum goes, not so good. Um, you know, you're going to have to get out some, like, you know, that's been a while since I cleaned around here. So you'd, you'd have to get out like a little toothbrush or something. Um, you might have more success with a with a, a brush. But in general, if you look at this, this is very, uh, it's organic. It's um, not harmful to the environment. And it definitely cleans out your sink. It does not smell uh, like oranges, like what you think um, an orange uh, scented cleaning product would smell like. It does still smell like vinegar. So if you're making this product at home, which is really simple, it's just vinegar and orange peels, right? And you keep it in a, um, like in a cupboard, a dark cupboard for three weeks or four weeks, whatever I read. Um, yes, you know, you're going to get a pretty clean sink. Um, this is, I'm going to try to apply some more to this scummy mark around my tap. Do, 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 do. do you sing while you clean? I do. Sometimes I have music in the background, but um, not on YouTube. Okay. Oh. Okay. I, you know, it's getting some of the scum and gunk out of there. Um, oh, wait a second. What is this? Okay. So, yes, it definitely cleans up the sink. It's not too powerful when it comes to caked in grime and gunk, as I like to call it. Um, but it does clean it up fairly well. Uh, it's going to take some arm power, do you know? So probably don't want to use this homemade product with a J-cloth. You probably want um, a sponge or something with a little bit of a grip on it. 
Um, also, um, just as a heads up, I have a cut on my finger <laughs> and um, be careful that you don't have any open cuts or anything on your fingers because if you do and you're using a homemade vinegar product with citrus in it, um, it's really going to sting. That's just as a heads up. But anyways, um, I give it, I guess, a good 8 out of 10 for cleaning a sink. This is the um, orange peel vinegar uh, homemade cleaner. Okay, uh, 10 out of 10 for being good for the environment. Maybe seven to eight for actually being able to clean. Um, I give it a, whew, maybe a five out of 10 for um, when it takes, when you're thinking about how long it takes to get something done. 10 being the shortest amount of time to clean something up with a product and um, uh, one being the best, I guess. I, um, I or one being the worst, I would give it at about five. Because it does, like when you're using this this product, this homemade product, it does take some time um, to get things clean. Okay, you need to use a sponge. Maybe it would be a shorter period of time. I'd say, you know, if I wasn't doing a YouTube video on this and I was just using this and really paying attention, uh, about two minutes to get this big sink done. Okay, so that's just my little review of this homemade product um, and more to come. Bye.